Well, I made it to Virginia here at Nathan's Cabin. Beautiful place. I'm getting ready to have some pizza. The weather has been kind of crappy already. But we're going to head out here this evening and hopefully get into something. I'm going to try my best to vlog, although I'm not good at it. I'm going to try. So, what do you say, Nathan? Going after him this evening. <laughs> hopefully, we get into some. So, we're excited. It should be fun. Uh, tomorrow is supposed to be pretty decent weather with little high winds, and then Saturday will be even better. So, that's probably our best shot. But we're going to go in anyways, see how we make out. Well, guys, it is about four o'clock. And I got in the stand about an hour ago. Um, about two miles in on this ridge that we've gotten lots of good pictures of bucks on here in Virginia. Or I should say Nathan has. So uh, coming in, it was pretty miserable. Um, ice and it's thick, so we got soaking wet. And luckily I had my jacket and bibs in my book bag, so... They didn't get wet, but all my base layers, everything underneath this layer is wet. So it's pretty chilly. Um, not expecting here much here this evening. Nathan's a couple ridges over and he has seen a deer or two. So um, I'm going to leave my stand here and hunt it first thing in the morning. And then maybe move uh, midday tomorrow if I have to um, down this ridge further and maybe down a couple. Uh, couple benches but it's pretty icy and uh and cold here in virginia so hopefully i can get an arrow and something it'll be pretty rewarding shooting something this far in i'm not used to hiking back in and hunting big mountains and big woods like this so it's pretty cool shot him. Let's just hope a uh, big mature buck does that now. <laughs> That's cool. Working right here on this, right on this transition from opening to kind of mountain world. It's where I figured they'd be running, so. it's where we're set up. back in here this morning and it's just too cold as you can see everything's frozen up so I'm tearing down I'm up on this ridge it's like 24 degrees I think and I'm gonna try to get down at the bottom where the wind's not as bad I think it's 24 degrees with 14 15 mile an hour winds so I made it an hour and a half my toes and my hands are freezing. Body's pretty warm, but hands and toes are just too miserable. So, uh, I did see some bear tracks on the way in. If it gets too cold, maybe I'll even go and track him down, but I'm gonna try to get down out of the wind for now. Well, 
guys, I finally got to got down off this top ridge. Made quite a bit of noise trying to get down in here with that heavy, 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 heavy pack set up. Definitely. Not a good setup for packing two miles in. So, if I'm gonna continue coming and doing this, I'm gonna have to get a lighter uh, mobile setup. But, any hoodles, as Matt Davis would say. I'm down on this point. And as you can tell, I don't have much of a view. So, what I think I might do I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm not happy with this setup. I think I'm gonna take a quick nap, eat some lunch, and then I think I'm gonna hike down and maybe unload my stand and pack at the trailhead and then go get on those bear tracks. I'm not too sure. I thought about just getting on those bear tracks and, and trying to catch up with them, but probably a lost cause with trad equipment you never know though so I'm just gonna enjoy the day if something comes along great if I don't even get back in the stand it's, I'm enjoying being out and uh, it's cold but it's fun being in big woods um, it's fun getting away from the cell phone the jobs not fun getting away from my family I miss them but it's fun having my uh, my own time out in the in the wild it's different than hunting you know close to home or private land in PA because you don't get this tranquility feel you know being by us by yourself or alone so Nathan is a couple ridges over a few miles but probably not even a mile maybe a mile or so but I'm gonna eat some lunch Good old peanut butter and jelly. Water. Some ignite in there. And I believe. Thought I had an apple left somewhere. I hope I do. Yep. Just a gold apple. I don't know where my wife gets these apples, but I'm hitting the spot right now. I got pretty sweated up coming down in here, so trust me, it's cold, but it kind of feels good right now. I'm gonna get bundled back up here and settle in. from me at least maybe not even and uh no just sitting here and all of a sudden he stood up and shaped and just walked right up there I grunted into him a few times but he wouldn't come um, and he stood there for maybe 20 minutes and the wind finally swirled and he he knew something wasn't right so he jumped out he didn't snort or anything he just kind of trotted away but Hey, at least we saw a buck today, and then I did bump a doe coming in, but um, finally warming up and getting nice. Uh, it's about 2 o'clock right now, so I'm going to sit here the rest of the evening and pack out. <laughs> 